All right, hey guys, all the angry nerd again, and I'm back with some more uh, uh, Wolf Among Us. The last time my video feed cut out on me, so we're gonna continue from uh, that checkpoint. Yeah, all right, I guess we're back. Sorry that the feed cut out. Uh -huh, it just it's kind of annoying like that. So just like with this whole new setup and everything, like I'm kind of like boxed in. But yeah, we're gonna continue. We're going down to the. Uh... Yeah, we're gonna continue. And next time I won't bump my thing to shut off the goddamn feed. <sighs> but yeah, like holy shit. Uh, this case is getting really crazy and really deep. And now we're at the Lucky Pond. It's dirty. No, it's not. It looks like you slept in it. In a pile of garbage. Oh, fucking Jack, 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 you, you asshole. I've seen you take a torn purse for a tenner. Yeah, but I also got her phone number. I don't want your phone number. Ugh, really? Whoa. Bigby's here. Oh, Where's your glamour toad? This is a surprise. Why are you never glamour God, toad? what is wrong with you? Why is it so you? hard to just follow the rules? Look, I know some fables can switch from man to beast and back again like changing shirts. But it's not so easy for the rest of us to look human, alright? And anyway, so I'm getting the money right now. I'm not taking the coat. But it's magic! So? And it'd be covering a check I already wrote. Okay, well, that sounds like a your problem problem to me. Yeah, it is. And so I came here to sell it off. Why would you think I'd take an ugly used Isn't this mule face skin coat? Because it's magic mule skin, that's why. Hey, wait a minute. That's Faith's coat. It was face coat. Look, you left it in my place. What do you expect me to do? Yes, I think the off-sighted statute of Finder's Keepers clearly states that it's his now, Bigby. So what's it gonna be? I don't know what to tell you. See if Cindy needs a coat. I don't know. <sighs> this is to pay for those bloody glamours, you know. You and your blinkered rules. If a witch's didn't charge so fucking much, I wouldn't have to be in here dealing with this snow nonsense. About this. You know, maybe Snow can help you out. How could Snow help me out? Give me an advance. A loan or something. She's kind of in charge of the business office now. Well, the last guy who was in charge didn't help us much, so forgive me if I don't expect anything different now. Yeah, well, that, that guy's a pervy old so cocksucker. Shouldn't be that big of a shock that I'm not gonna take an ass hair coat. No, I guess it shouldn't be, since this whole bleeding operation's just a setup for one of his shady fucking loans. Ixnay on the own lays, okay, Og Frey? I mean, what kind of a game are you running here? Toad? You turn down people's stuff so you can peddle his shit. Shut up. It's not worth it, Toad. What? Sometimes it's worth it? You know, depending. Fuck off, I mean, Jack. I don't even know what he's talking about. When has a crooked man loan ever been worth when it, When is it Jack? ever good? Well, I'll leave you to your business. I'm sure you'll have a lot to talk about. Good luck with that glamour, Toad. Fuck off! <laughs> yeah, Toad! How the hell do you expect me to get a glamour, then? It's not like I've got a lot of options. Here you go, my friend. Look, I'll... I'll give you some money, alright? You've gotta be kidding me. Do you even know how much a glamour costs? I've... I've never had to buy one. Keep your money, Sheriff. I've no patience for charity. If you're gonna be out like this, can't you at least wear a bigger hat? You know, it's getting old to tell the difference. Between what? Between the business office and fables like a crooked man, who you purportedly seek to protect us from. Either way, I'm getting screwed. Drop by any time. Sorry, alright? Look, I'm sorry, alright? What else do you want from me? He really grows on you. Look, 
I work here sometimes for the extra cash. It's something stable. You know, between more entrepreneurial bouts. And before you ask, I've never seen the crooked man in here. Neither hide nor hair and all that. Dumb bullshit, In fact, man. as far as I can tell, he's never even actually stepped foot in here. But Bloody Mary works for him. And the last time I saw her, she had the woodsman's axe. So? So the last time anybody else saw that axe, it was here. We'd never take something like that. Don't fucking bullshit me. Is this really why you came down here? The woodsman's axe? Because I don't know anything about it. Well, I'll be asking Yeah, I'll be asking questions, questions you piece Jack. of shit. Okay, fine. Fire away. Uh... Because I'm not a mind reader. Where about are these lines? And unless it's bar trivia, I don't think I can help much anyway. Tell me about these lines. Yeah, tell me about these lines. How do they work? Who collects? Look, people get desperate, and when you're drowning, anything that isn't sinking along with you looks like a life raft. The crooked man gives, and he wants things in return. And when you don't pay up, bad stuff happens. Why do you think I've never taken one? A little credit card fraud never hurt anybody. I should so you're saying he kills them? Bad stuff. You mean he kills them? Or worse. Simple Simon tried to open up a bakery, took out a loan to help with the expense, but when he started getting laid on the payments, the crooked man put him into one of the pies and served it to a litter of alley cats. At least, that's what I heard. Listen, I gotta start closing up shop. You're not so, running away uh, from me. Oops. It's the middle of the day. What can I say? Jersey likes to run at odd hours. And really, he'd be the one to talk to, so can't you just swing by later? It really wouldn't be good for me if he sees your face when he walks in. So, uh, I'd really rather you not tell physically be Jersey. here if he comes back. You know? What else can you tell me about Jersey Devil? Just that he's a fucking psycho and I like to stay out of his way. I typically work when he's not here, but I can call you when he comes back, all right? Shut the Get you fuck shut up, Jack. If the Jersey Devil isn't here to answer my questions, it also means he isn't here to get in my way. So I'm gonna take a look around, as long as I've got the elbow room. All right. Don't let me get in your way. I won't. Hmm. Just my luck. Oh yeah, I could. We could see your future in crystal balls and cushion. Reminds me of Briar Rose. You're not touching anything, are you? Oh, okay. Then. Well, you want me to come back there and kick the shit out of you? Is that what you want, Jack? You want to get in my way? No. Then fuck off. Oh, hey. Hey, look with your eyes, not your hands, okay? Uh, so... Alright, be right back for one second. <laughs>